Tonight, we are learning more about an intense fire that tore through a Providence triple-decker and damaged another building. The fire at the intersection of Bellevue Avenue and Dexter Street was first breaking on Eyewitness News at 5.30. News since then, we're hearing from a neighbor about the chaotic scene. Eyewitness News reporter Maura Kennedy has the latest developments from the Providence Mobile Newsroom. Crews are still investigating a fire that broke out in a vacant triple-decker building late Monday afternoon. Smoke pours out of this home on the corner of Dexter Street and Bellevue Avenue Monday afternoon, quickly spreading to the home next door. Luckily, the homes are vacant, but rumors of people being inside at the time of the fire had neighbors worried. It's a dangerous situation. It had to be amended. I don't know if the city, they had to demolish, they had to investigate what's going on because it's too much. Suspicious. The Providence Fire Chief tells Eyewitness News he believes the fire started on the second floor, destroying the rest of the home and igniting the house next door. The fire was large in, in, in volume, so we had to you know, fight it from the outside. We'll knock it down, then we'll bring in people inside to knock down a small fire. We spoke to the building's owner at the scene. He confirmed the building was vacant and that he's devastated over what happened. The wind also played a role in this fire. The breeze was so strong, it blew smoke across the street, which set off smoke detectors there. And the wind was in my way, so all my fire alarm in my house go off because the smoke was coming to my way, and we had to get out of the house. I was thinking, when I wake up, I was thinking my house, my house was on fire. Luckily, no reports of injuries as a result of this fire. Reporting with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Mark Kennedy, Eyewitness News.